In this video, I'm going to walk you through the home buying process. Step number one, pre-approval. You wanna make sure that you are pre-approved, that you spoke with a, a qualified and experienced loan officer who verified your income and assets to ensure you that if you found a house today that you would get pre-approved. Step number two, searching for homes. You go out with it with an agent and uh, you look at homes your agent schedules showings things like that and you look for the house of your dreams and then you get prepared for the next step step number three you found a house that you love and you want to put in an offer so you and your agent you sit down and you figure out okay what you want to offer your agent puts together the offer and then submits it over to the listing agent for that seller of the home and you wait for an answer usually it's 24 to 48 hours depending on the market step number four inspection you typically have a seven day window which is common a seven day window to get your home inspector that you hire out to inspect the home and to make sure that everything's good, make sure that you are aware of what's going on with the house, the age of, let's say, appliances, furnace, things like that, and then that prepares you for the next step. Step number five, congratulations. You got past inspection and now you are looking at moving forward. So, inspection came back fine, you let the other side know that everything's good, you're happy with the inspection, or the seller did something to make you happy with the inspection to move forward. So what happens is now you contact your lender, and your lender puts together uh, a loan package which gets sent over to the underwriter. They're gonna have everything that they need from you, probably updated payment information, uh, employment in info, things like that because sometimes it takes months to look for a house or it could take a week, it just depends. But ultimately your lender at this point submits everything to the underwriter and usually the, your lender, you being the buyer, would then pay the lender uh, a certain amount. It could be 300, it could be 500, it just depends on the size of, of the uh, home. Step number six is when everything's all said and done, your inspection's done, your appraisal came back good, or even if it came in bad, you guys negotiated, buyer and seller negotiated on the price, everything's good. The lender pushes to get every bit of information that they need from you and then turns it in to get a clear to close or CTC. What that allows you to do is it allows you, once you get it, to schedule a date and a time for your closing. This is when things get finalized, you the buyer become uh, the legal owner of the home, and then depending on what the, what the seller uh, told you in terms of occupancy, okay, the seller may need 30 days, let's say, which is very common, to move out, that's called occupancy. They essentially become tenants and they have that time frame or less to move out. So that's the home buying process. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial video. For more information, you can go to my website. It's allaboutthereelestate.com. Thanks for watching.